It is so impressive to me that you guys are hanging around for Tailwind. I think that is incredible. It just says you want more, right. and you want to talk, and yeah. you want to interact. And Jason, that's pretty dang cool. Yeah. So it's a cool part of the internet. You get to do that like right after the service, right uh -huh. after it happens. Right. So have a blast tonight as you dig, and boy, it ought to be lively. Jesus and politics. Oh, I know. I, I I had a question when I was thinking it through. You know, because I've listened to it, and one of the things that pops up, if Jesus was you know how we didn't get mixed up in the politics right. stuff very much? Right. But we as Americans, um, we vote. Yeah. I mean, now, now here's, here's a question. Would Jesus vote in your mind? I believe he would. Because part of being a good citizen is exercising your right in the political process. Mm -hmm. But I don't believe he'd broadcast that vote to anybody expecting them to be the same. So I believe he'd be involved. Okay. He said, render to Caesar what is Caesar's. Render to God what is right. God's. Right, yeah. So that's cool. So aside from, because um, for me, the big thing is, is just thinking through the submission mm -hmm. aspect of it, even, and for me, submission doesn't really kick in until the authority makes a decision that I don't agree with. Right. And that's when submission really starts kicking hard. in. Yeah, yeah. Before, it's not really submission. It's just yeah. doing what I want, you know, right. and it just happens to agree. Yeah. Um, but the submission thing with the prayer, how, how would be ways for us to... Because here's the deal. Around the water cooler, in the cubicle, yeah. everywhere, or on the news. Easy to blast your butt. You hear it all around, and it's, yeah. and it's really difficult not to fall into that trap. What would be a great way to kind of flip it? Like, I think prayer is totally the antidote, Jason. Here's what I've discovered. You may be somebody that really bugs me mm -hmm. and that really grates on me and just interacting with you or hearing about you just sets me off. But what I've discovered is when I earnestly start praying for you, God starts putting his love for you in my heart. So I think the reason that God put that peace in there on prayer is it is the antidote to oh. critical spirit. I can't stay critical of you very long if I'm praying for you. I can't be against you if I'm praying for you. Soon I'm going, I'm, I'm rooting for this guy to come along. I'm rooting for this guy to, to move on in God. So I think mm -hmm. prayer literally fixes the critical spirit. Awesome. Yeah. Awesome. Well, guys, uh, we will go ahead and continue on with our Tailwind service. That is that. We will see you in the chat. Have fun, guys. Bye.